saying. You've heard the term um, right place, right time, right? Okay, I want to encourage you this morning. In Acts 17, starting with verse 24, you can read how God has ordained everything under the sun, including man. If you think about it, you could have been born in any time frame. You could have been born any nationality on any continent on this earth, but you were born in this time. You were born on this particular, in this particular country, whatever country that is for you, but you were ordained to be in this time. God had you be born right now for a specific reason. What is that reason? Do you know? Have you asked the Lord, what is this reason? So I want to encourage you, get on your knees and pray. Ask God, why did you have me be born now? What's your plan and your purpose for me now? You weren't born in the Dickens era. You weren't born when Spanish flu was running around. You weren't born when people were having to take a ship to get everywhere. You weren't born when people were having to ride on horseback everywhere either. So be thankful for that. <laughs> but think about it. Ask yourself, what was the reason for me to be born during this time? And really thank God for it. And then ask him, how can you use me, Lord? What kind of vessel do I need to be for you to use during this time frame? This is an exciting time because we are seeing the manifestation of everything that the Bible talks about that was going to take place for Jesus to come back. So this is an exciting time. We are living the Bible out. We are seeing prophecy fulfilled day in and day out. You turn on the TV and you see something else take place. Then tomorrow we're going to turn on the TV and it's going to be something else revealed. So it's an exciting time. I don't I don't know about you, but I'm I'm stoked because I'm getting to see, I'm getting to live in biblical times, not just read about it, but I'm getting to live it. So get excited about that. Get excited about being a part of the Bible, getting being, being a part of prophecy. And then think about the fact that God ordained you to be a part of it too. Be blessed.